We home workers have been rumbled. Our tribe is under threat, Barbara Allen to view the full article, click the first link in the description below, long time home workers has coronavirus screwed with our sweet jig? Are people who normally go to workplaces now onto us? Please know that this piece isn't about the deathly seriousness of coronavirus. It's about sloth, furtiveness and very loose clothing. Mine, and possibly yours. It's about how, as lockdown rumbled on, many people realized they preferred working from home, WFH, for reasons aside from risk factors, and it's about how I'm a little unnerved by that. True homeworkers, like myself, devote our lives to building highly dysfunctional semi-agoraphobic shadow work worlds. It's our space that the new WFH lot have invaded, with their poxy Zoom meetings, ingenious lunches, and kitchen yoga. For many, WFH constituted a major lifestyle change, even a revelation. Sending work emails from sofas. Dumping real clothes for comfort. Ditching commutes. People aren't feeling any urge to return to help at a manger, or other high street businesses. Meanwhile, we seasoned homeworkers, stoic, noble with years of training and phone fear and muscle degeneration, barely merited a mention. No one asked how we were getting on. Which is fine. We're used to concentrating on the actual work, but otherwise being overlooked. We prefer it that way. Of course, not everyone enjoys WFH, it rather depends on the work and the home. People living in cramped conditions don't find it easy. Others are losing their jobs. Nor has it been a choice. When Kirsty Alsop commented that people should return to workplaces, or companies would realize they didn't need them, and outsource to cheaper overseas labor, she forgot a major factor, the government. It was the Tories' job to properly manage the pandemic so that people would trust their advice to return to workplaces. After months of incompetence, the government is way down people's most trusted-slash-respected lists. By my reckoning, they trail Joe Wicks, the Deliveroo app, and that long-time homeworkers has coronavirus screwed with our sweet jig? Are people who normally go to workplaces now onto us? Please know that this piece isn't about the deathly seriousness of coronavirus it's about sloth, furtiveness and very loose clothing to view the full article, click the first link in the description below.